A transducer is a device that converts one form of energy into another form of energy by the principle of transduction. For example, microphone and loudspeakers. Microphone converts sound energy into electrical energy and the loudspeaker converts electrical energy into sound energy. A transducer uses a sensor and signal conditioning unit to perform transduction. The sensor senses any change in the physical quantity and provides a non-electrical output. This output is then converted into a proportional signal using a signal conditioning unit. The output of the transducer is proportional to the input or measure quantity applied to it. A transducer is made of two main parts, the sensing unit or sensor, the signal conditioning unit or transduction. The sensing unit detect any change in the physical quantity or energy and provides an output. The signal conditioning unit then converts this output into an electrical signal that is proportional to the input quantity. Characteristics of a transducer. The characteristics of a transducer is divided into two groups. They are static characteristics, dynamic characteristics, static characteristics. Static characteristics of a transducers are those characteristics that is not a function of time. That is they do not dependent or vary with variation in the input signal or with time. Examples include 1. Accuracy. A transducer must have high accuracy to measure the physical quantity well. 2. Sensitivity. Must have the ability to sense the smallest change in a physical quantity and translate it efficiently into an electrical signal. 3. Repeatability. This is the ability of the transducer to produce identical output signal multiple times when applied with the same input signal. 4. Linearity. The ability of the transducer to vary its output linearly with input signal. 5. Stability. The transducer must be capable to provide a stable output and does not fluctuate. 6. Robust. Ability to withstand extreme conditions and mechanical stress. 7. Size. Should be compact without taking a lot of space for easy installing. Dynamic characteristics. The dynamic characteristics of a transducers are those characteristics that are function of time. That is, they're dependent on time. They include 1. Error. The difference between the measured reading and the actual reading. 2. The speed of the transducer in translating physical quantities into an electrical signal. 3. The efficiency of the transducer during conversion. 4. Hysteresis. The ability of the output not depending only on its current input but the previous input as well. Overall, both static and dynamic characteristics of a transducer determine its performance. Classification of transducers. Different types of transducers can be classified in various ways such as, based on their effects, based on their physical quantities, based on source of power, based on output conversion etc. We will be discussing on the classification based on source of power only. Classifications based on source of power. Under this category, they are of two types. 1. Active transducer. 2. Passive transducer. Active transducers. Active transducers do not require an external power source for it to work. The energy from the input is used to operate and produce a proportional electric signal. Examples include photovoltaic cells, piezoelectric crystal etc. Passive transducers. A passive transducers uses the exterior power supply for the conversion of energy, e.g. potentiometer. Types of transducers. Basically, there are two different types of transducers. 1. Mechanical transducers. 2. Electrical transducers. Mechanical transducers. Mechanical transducers are set of primary sensing element that responds to change in a physical quantity with a mechanical output. They are used to detect and converts various physical quantity. This output include displacement, force, pressure etc. Examples of mechanical transducers are 1. Pressure transducers. This type of transducers converts the pressure exerted into an electrical signal. It consists of an elastic material that bends when pressure is exerted on it. The bending is translated into an electrical signal used in a gas tank to measure pressure. 2. Ultrasonic transducers. Converts ultrasonic waves into an electrical signal. The ultrasonic wave is reflected from a surface, and it is detected by this transducers. Used for measuring the distance between the object and the transducer. 3. Flow transducer. Converts the flow of a liquid, gas, into an electrical signal. 
used for measuring the flow rate of any gas or liquid. 4. Displacement transducer. Converts linear motion or vibration into an electrical signal. Uses principles such as resistive, capacitive, inductive to measure the change in displacement. E.g. potentiometer. 5. Temperature transducer. Converts temperature into an electrical signal. Can measure the temperature on the surrounding. Examples of temperature transducer are thermocouple and thermistor. 6. Strain gauge transducers. Converts physical quantity like mechanical stress into an electrical signal. 7. Acceleration transducer. Converts the acceleration of a body into an electrical signal, e.g. accelerometers. Inductive transducer. Uses electromagnetic induction to detect changes in its self-inductance. Electrical transducers. These are determined based on the principle of operations. They are 1. Piezoelectric transducer. This type of transducer works on the principle of the piezoelectric effects. It generates electrical output that is proportional to the pressure, force, strain etc. Examples are quartz crystal made from silicon oxide, microphone etc. 2. Photovoltaic transducers. Converts light energy into electrical energy made of semiconductor material that contains p-n junction the p-n junction energizes light that enters it and converted them into current known as photoelectric current in the connected load 3. thermoelectric transducers this type of transducer converts thermal energy into electrical energy example of thermoelectric transducers is a thermocouple hall effect transducers works on the principle of hall effect used to detect magnetic field and converts it to an electrical signal. 5. Photoconductor transducers. Uses light intensity to convert physical quantities into an electrical signal. Light-dependent resistor is an example. 6. Electromagnetic induction transducers. Works on the principle of electromagnetic induction. Measures the change in inductance between the two coils. This is achieved by self-induction and mutual induction. 7. Electrostatic transducers. Makes use of two electrodes. A fixed and a movable electrodes. Both charged with opposite polarities. Change in the displacement of the movable electrodes is proportional to the voltage. Applications and uses of transducers. Use in health sector for diagnosing. Examples include ultrasound machine, thermometers, MRIS etc. Use in construction industry to measure stress in a building. Examples stress gauge. Use in transmission of electrical signal over a long distance. Example antennas. Use for determining pressure of a liquid or gas. Use in various electrical projects and solar cells etc.